Washington, secret, put it in the, secretary. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin suffered great pain keep medical emergency of January 1st, which descended to hospital for two weeks. And an assistant who wants a 70-year-old ambulance 911 operator. Lights of his lights. The distribution officer agreed to transfer the message by stating that they will close them when they turn into a settlement neighborhood. However, operator. Austin's law in Virginia. EMTs on the main streets and large streets require use of lights and sirens. He added, according 911 call, the defense secretary asked Lloyd Austin to take him hospital. Violetta Santos Mora file photo on January 5th. It turned out that secretary turned out to be aware of hospitalization of his colleagues in Pentagon and his boss in White House. After running to the Walter Reed National Military Medical Center in Bethesda, Austin, severe pain from urinary tract infection a complication from a prostatectomy he spent on. December 22 Silently Secretary Kathleen Hicks Jan.2.2 .2 Without telling him or other Pentagon colleagues about the reason behind him. Austin also could not tell the White House transfer his officials to Hicks. And then he did this after informing President Biden hospitalize on the 4th of January. However, entire story did not appear until January 9th, when Austin issued a statement that revealed a description of prostate cancer and previous surgery. By Walter Reed doctors this is both the Pentagon and White House. His privacy disappointed many people in Washington and called on both the Republican and Democratic. MPs to call his resignation. He said he planned to keep Austin as a defense secretary. According to Pentagon, Austin stayed hospital until Monday and worked most of his 15-day stay. He participated the planning of an airstrike on Houthi forces Yemen. According to Pentagon, Austin was brought to the Walter Reed National Military Medical Center for a complication of the Prostatectomy complication on December 22, AP photo Carolyn Castator. File Pentagon said on Monday. Now he works from home and receives physical therapy. In a statement on Saturday, Austin's doctor's power is backing back, he said. Secretary Austin's prostate cancer was treated early and effectively. And prognosis is excellent, he said.